Well, Mr. Mayor, if you please. I'll sell you your hash as soon as I get this premises off of my old store. <laughs> yes. Well, all right, but I'll have you know that I'm vouching for Tommy Gilas. That boy's got the confidence of every kid in town. You'll be standing in line waiting to shake his hand by the time our band plays its first concert. By the time your band plays its first concert, the individual members will have to foregather in wheelchairs as a count of the broken legs they'll get from tripping over their beards. And I'll tell you something else, my fine young feathered, my feathered young fine. Mm, never mind. Owen, Jason, you're it. Owen, come here. Sir, 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 sir. Calm down. I want that man's references, and I want him tonight. Don't you let him out of your sight. He's slipperier than a Mississippi sturgeon. You have no choice. Get his papers. Either get his papers or get him in jail. Couldn't make myself any clearer if I was a button hook in the well water. We'll be back. Professor Hill, I think it was abominable what Mayor Shit did. And I think it was wonderful of you coming to Tommy's defense like that. Oh, that was nothing. Yes, it was. No. A man can't cross the issue every time a little bit of personal risk is involved. Well, what does the poet say? The coward dies a thousand deaths, the brave man only five hundred. Well, unfortunately, the mayor was pretty mad on account of his billiard parlor. Now, I suppose a recommendation from a musical authority like yourself would help, but I couldn't ask you to do anything like that. Why, Professor Hill? You would? Well, of course, but I would just like to be a little bit more informed. You see, I've been wanting to talk to you about Winthrop's coronet. His coronet? Oh, uh, Mother of Pearl, Keith. Yes, I'm sure it's fine. It's just that he never really touches the coronet. Oh, the first week or so, he made a few experimental blats, I uh, guess. Yes, so. yes, blats. And he put, he sings the menu ad and G-la-di-da almost constantly. La-di-da, di-da, 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 la-di-da, la-di-da. But he never touches the coronet. Well, you see. He says that you told him it wasn't necessary. Well, he tells me about this thing system that if he thinks the menu at G, he won't have to bother with the notes. Now, Professor. Miss Marion, the thing system is a revolutionary new method. I'll admit. But so was Galileo's conception of the heavens, Columbus's conception of the egg, uh, globe, Bach's conception of the well tempered clavichord. Now, we won't discuss these things here in public, but if you'll allow me to call, when may I call? I internet this week. Oh, <laughs> 